Hello, I'm Kyle Bennett from Hastel Studios and Hastel Minis. I'm going to do this tutorial fast. Um, it's going to be a uh, basics for Adobe After Effects CS4. If we're going to be doing lots of tutorials for it, I just want to cover the basics of it. So I'm going to do that here. Okay, so the first thing is this page pops up. You just close that if you want. It's got a few shortcuts. Um, but the first thing you need to do before you do anything on your video page is go to the composition, new composition. 1920 by 1080, I'm just going to do that. Uh, duration 59 seconds, I'm just going to change that to 10. So this is your basic settings, your width and height, so you can change that to 1280 by 720 or whatever you want to do. So I'm just going to leave it at 1920 by 1280. Because that's full HD. Uh, duration. So this is whatever you want to do for the start time. I mean the length of your composition. So just click OK once you're happy with it. Okay, so now to import things. You want to... Oh, by the way, your name of the composition is up there. Or you can go into here and rename it here. I'm just going to call it Tutorial. Right, if you want to import footage, you can either go File, Import, File, Multiple File, File, blah, blah, blah. Or you can right-click into this project box, go Import, File, Multiple Files, blah, blah, blah. So I'm just going to go File, and I'll import, I'll import this Epic Wolf. Okay, so you can either drop it down here, and it'll drop it in the center. Or you can drop it here and if you go to the center it'll automatically lock straight onto it or you can just drag it wherever you want but um a cool thing about it is you can drag it down into this box here and this is a create composition but it'll create it the exact same size as what the picture is so this way you have this uh picture that's exactly the same size and that'll save you from having to resize perfectly into the comp. But you know, that's pretty cool. So we'll go back into our first comp and I'm going to show you a few things here. If you go into layer, new, you can create all of these things like text, solid, light, camera, null object, shape layer, adjustment layer, and we're just going to create a solid for now and click OK. So we're naming it to effects because we're going to apply effects to here. And all these effects are stored here. And you know this color correction. So you can go, say, I'll just go into the hue saturation. If I click colorize. I can change the color, except this is just a black box, so it's not going to do anything. So now, I'll just exit that. We'll delete it. So there's heaps of effects up here that you can choose from. Uh, I won't go into that now, but now there's effects and presets. So all your presets are here, up in this animation presets. So say I want text presets. I can get blurs and animating in and animating out so that's all cool and I'll do some um, masking now so if I go into solid I can click OK I can just use this pen tool up here and the keyboard shortcut for that is G and I can just do that and if I click this button this one here it'll make everything that doesn't have a background say there's a part showing on your thing that just goes all the way to the end then you click that and that'll show all of it that's the transparent part and if I go into this mask I can do stuff like I can feather it I can make it so it animates on and all that kind of stuff so now um, there's more than one tools for um, for 
masking so I'll just delete this mask here so it's back to normal and I will uh, show you a few keyboard shortcuts so zoom in and out it's the uh, comma and full stop so you can use those to zoom in and out of your project if you want to use the hand tool to drag around your project you click H to go back to the the um, cursor tool just click V if you want to use this pen tool just click G so there you go that's a few basic things anyway that's all I'm gonna show you today I hope you enjoyed the tutorial it was only short hopefully uh, check out our website it's h2hstudios.tk just have a quick look at it um, by the way uh, we have another channel called Hastow Studios check that out it's our main channel it's pretty good so have a look at that the link is at the top hope you enjoyed the tutorial goodbye